right? Not so bad there. Had a little bit of that chop though, right? So let me take that from you one second. You stay right there. So the chop is like I was saying, it was like you were coming down and you were almost torquing the club, you know, and the, the club and the physics of it all, this thing all, club head always wants to follow wherever the direction you're moving this handle, right? Yeah. So when you come over here and you think about spearing something out over there, this thing would just trail behind. Um, and so as soon as we said, hey, get that thing feeling like uh, you said hold the angle, which is what you felt, right? Which is cool. So what happened was this thing started pointing out to the right of where you wanted to go, you know, and the club started going lower, lower, lower. Instead of over here, you were above your head on a couple of those iron shots, okay. you know, and all of a sudden you started shallowing the club. Now we we're also talking about K position, yeah. right? Make sure you get in the K. Stay in the K. Stay in the K, get your upper body over this leg and then hold the angle coming in and that's starting to shift your plane. Great. I think it's do that rep again where you um, get the club shaft pulling down. Just that pump drill, I called it, right? So there's there's the anti over the top, right? Okay. Yeah. You can see how that pulls the right shoulder, you know, kind of lower than the left as well. Yeah. yeah. Get the K position. Let me see that. And the over the toppers need to get into the K. Let the, the K? Yeah, it's beautiful there. Then your head's just going to feel like it stays over the right shoe on the way back. Getting there. Now you want to get the feeling of this release deal. Let me have your club. You can stay right there again. The release deal is this: is you got it over here. We know the pump drills here. Okay, now we got to get rid of the pump, right? Which is like swinging the club in the same direction this was pulling, or swinging to the right. So if I'm trying to hit that way, my practices might be over here, just swinging. You know, coming. Okay, I'll to a way that yeah, okay. you can see. So, you know, I'm hitting this way, but your practice is you're going like pumping, right? Yeah. Now you're pumping in a direction that's out to the right. Yeah. Uh, okay. So you also want to practice the swinging of the club past your body to the same direction. You know, so if you let the club pass your hands and it's behind me, unless I turn like this to pull it around, it would just kind of sail out to the right, you know, but it's the crossover. You got to do that crossover a little sooner behind. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I didn't yeah. see that. I know. Oh. There's power there missing. I hear it. Yeah. You can hear the whoosh, right? Yeah. Yeah. Because I do it too late. Exactly. Early is here, center's whatever, and there's late. And Late's a slice. Late. I think you had more zip on that thing. You gotta think about just snapping the hands over a little bit, okay? Mm. Yeah, see if you can make that whoosh over here. Lift it up, yeah. Late. That was late. That's, that's early. That's it's, exactly. It's not what I do, yeah. Okay. So that's a real strange deal there, but that's way early. A lot of people can't figure out how to do what you just did. I'll tell them to, and they just can't do it. But I'm pretty aware of what's happening here. Here we go. Exactly. See the curve on that Wait, thing? It would say it's over there. Oh. And it was like, Meow. that's the thing, man. You want to, you want to, you know, do too much and then back off it. Right? Right. Now you got to understand that this creates speed, hand yeah. speed, wrists and hands can make a lot of speed happen, right? If you're trying to get it all with your body, you're only going to turn so much and you're going to hold it and it's going to go to the right and all that stuff. Over curving the ball and it got a little... Yeah funky so now we're just putting the pump drill in to get that thing slotted in there again that's between the two here we go very nice I don't think you turn that one away that's far the ball will go far there because you get like I said you get more ball speed when you draw the ball Make sure you got I mean, that it's left, it's, I can't tilted. Uh, it make sure you got tilt this way. Yeah, there you go. Good job. How's that? that one felt good. 
You like them when they go high and straight? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, some people do. Yeah. Hey everybody, what's happening? It's Gormanator here. I just want to let you know that I'm doing live Zoom lessons. The next best thing to an in-person lesson, a live Zoom. So if you want to kick that slice to the curb, hop in and let's get going. I've got my launch monitor and the tools I need. If you're at the office, work, wherever, we can get it done. Click the link down below, hit the page. It'll tell you all about the lesson and how it works. You'll be excited to get it done because I'll take care of you. See you guys on the next video.